Hi guys, uh, welcome to the last video of the uh, project, the final project of XHTML and CSS. This is just a little video to inform you that I found some problems in the links. Okay, if you want to put the links working like it is in here, okay, with the hover effect, you have to go to your style.css, open it, you have to delete these um, these uh, lines of code which is the visited so you don't need that and the active okay make sure you delete that only leave the hover which is the only effect we uh, want and then you can refresh the page and you'll see that everything is working perfectly okay you can also um, create uh, the logo image normally in um, in the logos uh, when you go there and, cl and click it's uh, a link to the main page you can also do that uh, by going to the index.html5 and in here create an href link to index.html and here let's close this and now here obviously now you have to copy this and put it in here Rem don't forget to close the anchor tag and uh, in the contact page as well don't forget closing anchor tag and that's it if you go to the page now and refresh you'll see that now when you mouse over the logo it's um, it's a link okay so you can click it and you will go always to the, your index.html file uh, or HTML page let's click here okay that's it if you go to the contact click here everything you always go back to the main page uh, another feature that I want to include in this website is uh, the icon that you normally see in here, okay, in the tabs. And um, in Firefox, you as well see in the address bar, you can always see the icon as well uh, for each different uh, website. Um, in Chrome, this will not work. In Chrome, we will only see the icon in the tabs. So I'm going to show you how to create uh, or grab an image and uh, put the image as your icon in the tab or the um, uh, URL address. Uh, to do that, we need an image. And I already have my image here in the images. Uh, it's uh, this one here. It's the mini.png okay and now we need to go to um, to a website called favicon okay or fav icon and it's in it's this one here it's the favicon fav icon here it is fav icon okay click there the URL is uh, favicon.htmlkit.com uh, slash favicon. Now you have here uh, choose archive. So let's choose an archive from our website. And the archive or the image that I want is that one that I showed you before. So it's in here, final project images. It's the mini.png. Open it and click generate favicon.ico and just wait a second until it generates the icon and now here it is okay so you have here uh, two different uh, fav icons you can download you can download this one here which is constantly moving as you can see it's a gif or this one here okay which is the static one now you can download the favicon package download it 
and we are done with that so let me open what I've downloaded here it is uh, this should be this should be the animated five icon gif and this is the static one so I prefer the static one and what we'll do is uh, grab the favicon.ico and put it in um, in the images folder okay now let's go back to notepad and here and now we need to put here a link this is link rel equals and here you type shortcut icon href equals now you type images uh, which is the folder and now you type the name of the file was favicon ICO and um, favicon dot ICO and there it is okay that's it now if you save it and we try to open the um, the index file let's go to the index file let's open this and let's say let's try Firefox you'll see that we already have the perfect icon for the website it's uh, pretty much the F of Facebook but in background white so uh, but pretty cool okay so you have it here in the tab and in the URL but if you go for example to if you open it in Google Chrome it will only appear well it's not appearing here so something is wrong let me refresh yes okay so it's not appearing here because uh, we're not working on uh, localhost or we're not um, working on a server and the website is not in a server okay it's in our computer that's why the, the icon doesn't appear it will only work for you to see this will only work in Firefox but um, as soon as you put your uh, website in uh, in the in a server or a hosting company the logo will appear uh, before I end this video just a quick little update on the link states uh, I forgot to mention you that uh, if you put the four link states okay um, you need to put it in this perfect order first you need the default link state which is the link okay uh, then you have to put the visited for visited links the hover to change the color to white when we hover over a link and the active okay um, if you don't have the link states in this order okay first the link then visited hover and active you'll have uh, a few little problems with the links and the colors so make sure you have all in this order or you have only the uh, hover link state uh, but if you put the four of them you need to be it need to be in this order okay um, and that's it that's all for um, the final project. I hope the, the project is working well. But if you have any questions or the project is not working uh, for you, just send me a private message or put your comments in the, um, in the comment section uh, at the right side. Okay? Uh, see you guys later and see you in the next chapter. Bye.